I'm sitting here in my garden and just spending time with God alone as how I usually do every day. I call this my quiet time, QT. And um, I'm just inspired in my spirit to just share this. And this is something that I say all the time. You know, um, I always say this to people that there is nothing that we can do or have done to make God love us more or less. And reason would be because God's love for us is already it's already at a maximum level. It's already at the highest level, at the deepest level, at the widest level. So there's nothing that you or I or anyone could do to make God love us more or less. It's already the, at the maximum. So forget trying to make God love you more. Or for those of you who think that there's something that you have done to make God love you less, trust me, there's nothing that you can do to make God love you less. God's love is the best, the greatest. No love can be compared to His love. No man, no woman. He, Jesus went on that cross more than 2,000 years ago at Calvary. Long before I repented, He died for me. Long before I walked away from my sinful lifestyle, He died for me. He loved me. He loves me. He loves you. No one, even the people who claim to love you, people out there, no one's love can be compared to Jesus' love. So today, take a moment to just receive this truth. Jesus loves you. You know, I... I, I Enjoy the love of Jesus. I believe in the love of Jesus. Not because other people believe. I believe the love of Jesus because I've experienced it. I've tasted it. And I always say this. All the love put together, all the love the people have for us put together cannot be compared to the love of God. And I always love singing this song even to the people that I preach to this children's song and I just want to share this song with you Jesus loves me this I know Jesus loves me this I know for the Bible tells me so little ones to him belong they are weak, but my Jesus is strong. Yes, my Jesus loves me. Yes, my Jesus loves me. Yes, my Jesus loves me. For the Bible tells me so. Now I'll sing to you, Jesus loves you. This I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to Him belong. They are weak, but my Jesus is strong. Yes, Jesus loves you and I. Yes, Jesus loves you and I. Yes, my Jesus loves you and I. For the Bible tells me so. So remember, remember this all the days of your life. Whenever you feel like God doesn't love you, or you feel like God has stopped loving you, or you feel like you need to do something to make God love you more, stop it. There's nothing that you and I can ever do to make God love us more or less. Just nothing. Just nothing. Just embrace His love. Even right now as you listen to the sound of my voice, just breathe in the love of God wherever you are. And especially on days when you feel unloved and when your loved ones on this earth makes you feel unloved, you remember... God 
the Almighty God, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, the great I Am, loves you. He loves you like crazy. Crazy love, as Beyonce says, that is the love of God. Shalom. Have a blessed day. Bye. Thanks for watching.